Hi, welcome to Learn It Easy YouTube channel. Subscribe for more videos, standards, and approvals in firefighting systems. In this unit, we will discuss standards, approval, and certification need to be considered in firefighting designing, selection, installation, and maintenance. The essential standards are NFPA for National Fire Protection Association. UL, for Underwriters Laboratories, NBC, National Building Codes, FM, Factory Mutual Research Cooperation, LPCB, Loss Prevention Control Board, VDS, is short for German word, in English inspected approved safe, let's discuss each in details, NFPA, stands for National Fire Protection Association, is a global non-profit organization established in 1896 devoted to eliminating death, injury, property and economic loss due to fire, electrical and related hazards. It's widely known for codes and standards organization. Over 200 technical codes and standards are designed to minimize the risk and effects of fire by establishing criteria for building, designing, selecting, installation and maintenance of firefighting and alarm systems. Like NFPA 10 for portable fire extinguishers, NFPA 13 for installation of sprinkler systems, NFPA 25 for inspection, testing and maintenance of water-based fire protection systems, NFPA 72 for fire alarm and signaling code, etc. We will discuss each in detail, respective units. Now just look at how to access NFPA standards. NFPA provides free online access to all of their codes and standards. Refer the description for web link. Let's look at how to access the desired code from nfpa.org. I am just logging to nfpa.org. As you can see, if you want to access the codes online, you have to sign up first. I already created and log in to my profile. Now I just click on list of code and standard from codes and standard tab. As you see, we got redirected to codes and standard page. Here we have a list of all the available codes. This. From this, I am just selecting NFPA 1. A lot of information available in here regarding standard. You can refer this all by yourself. I am just gonna show you how to access it. Here you can see free access to the 2015 edition of NFPA 1. And the important thing is you should verify your email ID first. If you are successfully verified your email ID, a pop-up window like this will appear. You can access it very easy like this. You can use content for easy access. UL, UL is short for Underwriters Laboratories. Unlike NFPA, UL is an approval standard. They help companies to demonstrate, deliver safety, and confirm cutting-edge quality and performance for devices or fittings that used in firefighting systems. By offering inspection, advisory services, and certification, they are one of the oldest testing agencies. They break their certification into being listed, recognized, and classified UL listing service verifies that manufacturer can make products that fulfill UL requirement meaning that they can make any product with the UL listed marks UL recognition service is different in that it does not apply to a final product instead it certifies the components inside it as it not seen often by consumers like fire control panel board or power supply unit etc UL classification services used evaluate any specific criteria of products like performance under specific conditions like fire shock resistance etc link to respective web pages are added in the description NBC 
NBC, National Building Codes, a comprehensive building code, or standard, is a national instrument providing guidelines for regulating the building construction activities across the country, specified by appropriate governmental authority by law. The building must confirm the code to get planning permission, usually from the local council. The main purpose of the code is to protect public health, safety, and general welfare as they relate to construction and occupancy of building and structures. It gives the guidelines for firefighting system installation on the building in that country. Refer the description for a link to NBC directory of all the countries. Factory Mutual or FM Global Research is an approval standard and FM Approvals is the independent testing arm of international insurance carrier. They using scientific research and testing to make sure products confirm to highest standards for safety and property loss prevention. Products that pass get the FM approved mark. They testing fire protection equipment on their fire technology and hydraulic laboratories by replicate fire to test automatic sprinklers and mock up for special protection fire extinguishing systems and water mist system among other products. They also test hydraulic, mechanical and environmental tests on fire protection systems components and relative devices including sprinklers, coupling, valves and water mist nozzles. These tests confirm that the devices and the corresponding system will work as intended when properly installed and maintained. Different FM standards are FM 4471 for Class 1 fire panel roofs FM 4881 for Class 1 fire exterior wall FM 3010 for fire alarm signaling systems. You can check other standards and details from their website. For that just go to www.fmapprovals.com. They also provide FM loss prevention data sheet to reduce risk at your existing facilities as well as those under construction. It's important to have proven engineering guidelines. Look no further than FM Global Property Loss Prevention Data Sheets. These exacting standards help you reduce the chance of property loss due to fire, weather conditions, and failure of electrical or mechanical equipment. They incorporate nearly 200 years of property loss experience, research, and engineering results, as well as input from conscious standards committees, equipment manufacturers and others. Access them free of charge through fmglobaldatasheets.com. LPCB, Loss Prevention Certification Board, is a leading international certification body in the field security and fire protection and loss prevention standards by LPCB is recognized by governments and regulatory authorities across the world, especially in the Asia Pacific, Middle East, and Europe, the LPCB approval process involves assessment and testing of products to ensure that they meet quality standards set by a team of experts who may be regulators, insurers, designers, manufacturers, installers, engineers, and scientists. Approval of products is usually based on testing undertaken by the LPCB's world-renowned testing laboratories. This approval is maintained by regular audits to ensure that the product continues to meet the approval criteria. Once they satisfied the product they include the firm into their red book. VDS it's short for German word Verbung der Schädigung the Citra, which means trust through security. It's a German standard for firefighting system testing, inspection, and approval for firefighting system components. VDS is short for German words meaning trust through security. Their inspection services includes water, gas, and special extinguishing systems, fire detection and alarm system, 
smoke exhaust ventilation systems, fire resisting closures, and voice alarm system. Conclusion We hope that you enjoy the look at firefighting standards and approvals, as we see in standards and codes should be considered from designing to installation and maintenance of a system for safe and economic benefits. For more in-depth information what's covered in this unit, you can always refer to our website. We sure to explore other units in this module to learn more about the firefighting systems, as well as the fire detection and alarm systems. You can always visit our website www.learneteasy.com